Good morning and welcome back to 41 Today. 20 years ago, Sunny Carter Elementary opened its doors to Bibb County students and this year the school is celebrating the big milestone and joining us this morning to talk all about it is the principal Latricia Reeves and media specialist <laughs> Kelly Ennis. Good morning ladies. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. So let's start off with Miss Ennis. You mm -hmm. Been it for the long haul. Kind of tell us a little bit about about that. Now, the first time I went in the building, I had to wear a hard hat because it wasn't finished yet. We were uh, slated to open fall of '93, but we just had torrential rains all mm -hmm. fall. So we opened in January, mm -hmm. and our students were housed at four different schools from August to December. And we all came together in January to open up Sunny Carter. Mm -hmm. And talk about the progression. Just I mean, 20 years. It's mm -hmm. a very long time and a big, a big milestone. Uh, a big milestone. Um, I, Kelly will have to speak to when it first opened, but just since I've been there, there have been a lot of renovations done um, and just some neat things that have happened. So we're really excited. We've had new roofing, um, you know, just carpet placed in. We had a whole reconstruction uh, done of our parking lot. Um, and so we've, we've had some uh, exciting uh, renovations done. Talk about the, the person who is this, the school is named yeah. after. Oh, uh, Manly Lanier, Sonny Carter. Sonny was his nickname. Mm -hmm. And he is actually from, uh, lived in Warner Robins, grew mm -hmm. up, but then came to high school. They moved to Macon when he was in high school. Okay. And Sonny was your Renaissance man. Yes. He was an Eagle Scout. <laughs> he was a, a doctor. Top Gun. Went to Emory, Top Gun pilot, right. professional mm -hmm. soccer player. Wow. Mm -hmm. um, Sounds like a, a superhero. He was yeah. a test pilot, and then he became a NASA astronaut. Mm -hmm. And wow. his uh, shuttle flight was a discovery. It was mm -hmm. NASA's first night launch, mm -hmm. and also it was a classified mission, so we don't know what they did. <laughs> um, a lot of our students thought that Sonny was killed in a shuttle mission, mm -hmm. but he actually died in an ASA small plane crash on the way to Brunswick, Brunswick. Mm -hmm. oh. and there was I think everyone on board 22 people died mm -hmm. but he was an inspiration a role model and Absolutely. he loved to go and talk to students Absolutely. loved to come to school yeah. so and so the friends of Sonny Carter which included a lot of Macon um, prominent people mm -hmm. got together and when they started construction on our school and tried to decide on a name they thought nothing would be more appropriate than this man That's who awesome. was everything anybody could aspire to be. Mm -hmm. That's incredible. Mm -hmm. So talk about what this celebration is going to be all about and it, when it is. Yeah, well the celebration is tomorrow. It's um, February 27th. Uh, we'll start up at 530 um, and we have a, a, a program planned for 615. Um, but for me, the celebration is going to mean, you know, revisiting our namesake um, and then just a whole, it's inspirational, you know, uh, inspiring our students to challenge the edge of the universe, um, just being able to look back um, and to see where our school has grown and where it has come from. So I, we've got math and science activities planned. It is just going to be a fun, fun time. We've got former administrators and teachers mm -hmm. coming back. All of our first um, year staff received an invitation yeah, to come absolutely. back. Absolutely. Uh, the first principal, uh, Mr. Donald Black, will be there. Cool. Um, Karen Yarber is going to be there as well, a, a former principal. Um, John Clay, was he in John the first Clay class? John Clay Flanders yeah. was in third grade <laughs> yeah. the year we opened. And he is uh, works at Robbins Federal Credit Union yeah. now. And Fantastic. The branch manager. He'll be there to speak. Yeah. But Great. When we opened, we had 12 mobile classrooms. Wow. Which was, and we were state of the art. We were the first school to open and make them with an automated media center. Very mm -hmm. cool. Well, Miss Ennis mm -hmm. and Miss Reeves, thank you guys so much for joining us thank this you. morning. Thank we're going to take a quick commercial break, but again, the 20th thank anniversary you. celebration is Thursday night at Sunny Carter Elementary from 530 mm -hmm. to 730, and everyone is invited. 